This is an ultrasound case of a fetus, a female fetus with mild uh, polyhydramnios. The woman presented with mild polyhydramnios. Anomaly scan. Here we see a large cystic structure in the abdomen of the fetus. At the first look, we can see that it is oval shaped and distended, and it contains internal echoes. The shape is of a distended urinary bladder, but on transverse sex section we see the urinary bladder anteriorly here. This is the urinary bladder, and this is the large cystic structure in the abdomen. So this cystic structure is not the urinary bladder. This is a hematometrocolpus filled with blood, blood products, and this explains the internal moving caustic particles here, seen clearly by ultrasound. So this beer-shaped cystic structure in the pelvis of this fetus is a hematometrocolbus which is a distended vagina and uterus due to likely imperforate human or vaginal atresia. Here we see a small amount of ascites in the abdomen anterior to the this cystic structure here by color double we see the insertion of the umbilical cord and we see the iliac arteries The FL was small for gestational age and I noticed also an abnormal position of the thumb of the foot. Rest of the anomaly scan was normal except for small small degree of pelvic cell dilatation due to the distended vagina and uterus compressing the ureters. So at first look uh, one may say that this is a distended urinary bladder or a megacystis and by seeing a small amount of pelvic cell dilatation in both sides one can say that there is a lower urinary obstruction and PUV may be considered here in this transverse section we see the right the left kidney which is dilated here is the dilated left kidney and this is the right kidney here left kidney 
and right kidney here, which is less evident 